Welcome back, insufferable gaming fans. Your old pal Rosser here. Just a few more of these to go, and this one is Spider Boy. What wonders will this bring us? Mutant Spider. Okay. Looks like we've got uh, some pretty good damage output. I'm cool with that. Again, I always like getting the spread shot in Contra, but then again, who doesn't? We'll stop by the curse room, see if we can get some free stuff. Three flies, three flies, and two spiders. And it looks like we have another secret room here, which didn't really help much. So I lost a little health there, but I saved a bomb. And in the end, isn't that what really counts? Ooh, and it looks like I've got uh, slowing shots as well. So even better. Yes, this should do nicely for my purposes. I do like have slowing shots. And I do like outputting a lot of damage in a hurry. And we've got ourselves a spacebar item. The Shoop de Whoop, which hasn't been used in quite some time. But which occasionally is used to great effect. Now if I can just hunt down some hearts for myself, I think I'll be alright. See, if I had wasted that bomb, I wouldn't be able to use it on this tinted rock. Which could very well drop the things I need. Or a key. Keys, keys are good too. Alright. Let's see if I can make my way... Well, I was hoping for some heart refills. But I guess I don't really need them, need them. I just have to avoid taking hits. And it would help if I was actually able to hit the enemies. That would be cool too. Very dangerous times we're living in here. I'll try to defeat the little one first if I can. If I can. That way, I'll be able to get another damage upgrade, in theory. Although, this isn't fully tested, so... It's possible I have no idea what I'm talking about. But wouldn't that be great if it worked out for me? I think it would. What did we get? Nope, we got, uh, little Steve. So we've got a familiar. Oh well. It was worth a shot. Maybe I need to unlock the other thing, Steven. Which roosts in my head. I do not know all the details. Just something I saw a couple of times. Which way... There sure are a lot of locks, rocks in this level. Locks in this rubble. Listen to me. Speaking improperly and whatnot. Hmm. Maybe Isaac's fork gives me some regenerative qualities. That is possible, since I just regenerated a heart when I beat that room. I'm cool with that, of course. Not something I will scoff at. Especially being down a couple of hearts, as I was. Let's make quick work of these. Yeah. Sometimes I'm able to lob it right through the rocks. Not always, though. He can't rely on it. It's a sketchy proposition at best. I'm going to finish exploring this floor. Well, look at all you. All lined up for me. Fish in a barrel. I'm getting a monopoly on keys today, it seems. Hmm. 
Hmm. Well, I've got extra keys. Speed up. I like it. It's good for me. It's good for you. That wasn't good, though. Taking a hit. I need to try to not do that so much. Oh, it's really hard to get a fix on where exactly I can dodge in here. But yeah, I did just get some more health regen, so that's definitely what the fork is doing for me. Now I know. And who do we have this time? Larry Jr. Shoop de Whoop could potentially take him out immediately if I don't miss. I tend to miss a lot with this though. Oh, got one of them. Just barely. And the multi shots should take care of the rest for me. There we go. Piece of cake. And a squeezy for tears up. Which, this thing being as slow as it is, frankly, I need. I'll take all the tears up I can get. Get, get, get. What next? Some grubs. Not too bad. I've dealt with grubs before. The eyeless wandering back and forth ones especially. Ain't scared. More keys. Keys upon keys. Continuing our theme from the last run of not getting bombs and instead getting keys, I suppose. Maybe that'll change. It did not change. Huh. What do you know? I guess this would be a great time for Guppy's tail. If it does what I think it does. And I think it does. Well, I don't have enough bombs to handle that. And not much point in going into the shop because I can't really afford anything. Or at least nothing really good. Haha! The day is mine. This bomb is mine. This whole damn floor is mine. What are you going to do about it? Oh, okay. Shoot me with a bullet. Good answer. Very effective. It's what I would have done in your situation. But now you're dead. How does that make you feel other than dead? Grumble, grumble, gotta go all the way back just to check the extra rooms. Fistuly. Bombfly fistula. Nothing to sneeze at, especially in a room where there's not a ton of room to dodge. I will go into this cursed room and then I will go into that library. <laughs> Nothing good came of that. Well, these things happen. Can I get a freaking book of revelations anytime? Clearly not. You know what? I'm going to take the book of sin this time just so I can get some item drops. And right now we've got judgment. Wonder if he'll pay off in five cents or less. Um. Not looking like it. Maybe I should have saved that until I had some more money. What do you think? Ah, Wells. We still have plenty of opportunities to grab free stuff on the way. We've floors to go and Gertie to kill. Gertie, Gertie, Gertie. This boss has been known to give me trouble on more than did not see that fly there. Occasion is the word that I was trying to use before I was rudely interrupted. Wow, good thing that was slowed down or I'd have been in 
that kind of trouble. I can't rely on the slowing effect to work all the time because sometimes it just doesn't do its job right when I expect it to. Oftentimes when I need it the most it fails me. So I should always just assume that this is going to be the case and not take any foolish risks. But if I wasn't taking foolish risks it just wouldn't be one of my runs, now would it? Tears and hit points up. Good, good. That's good. That's a Bonk's Adventure reference right there. A game that is not remembered by many these days. Unless it's by classic game buffs, which a pretty high percentage of my fans are anyway, so I guess most of you do remember Bonk's Adventure. Or, at the very least, you remember seeing commercials for it at some point, back in the day. Back when we still got our entertainment through such Philistine methods as televisions instead of the internet. Like cavemen. Okay. They're sending all of these guys at me, aren't they? Should remember to use that Book of Sin. Get- whoa. More free stuff. Bomb drops chief among them. Would be nice. That's good too. Look at all these swell keys. Net gain, two bombs. Excellent. Also, these quad tiers really douse the fires quickly, don't they? Heh, <laughs> they really douse the skulls quickly, too. That saves me a lot of trouble. Hmm, should I bother with the fork? Well, I've got bombs now. Or, not the fork, the card. Give me the card. It's the stars. There is no item room. It'll just take me somewhere else. wonder if there's a secret here. This looks like a good place for a secret room. It was not the secret room, in fact. Now don't I look stupid. Hey, it was an easy mistake. Anyone could have made it. Alright. Now we're getting some bombs. Now we're fighting more fistula in this exact same type of room. Except instead of bombs, they turn into grubs or maggots or whatever the hell those things are. Who knows? Probably anyone with basic research skills. And again with the slot machine. Doesn't seem like I'm finding very many killer items in the secret rooms ever. Yes, you blow up real good, please. Huh, nice shot, little guy. I commend you. Back we go, back we go. Once we didn't find the boss before we finished exploring the level. A nice change of pace. Yep. I'd say those guys are pretty much done for. And these guys nearly caught me in an ambush. But I was somehow able to dodge at the last second. I take a card. The sun, that's the best card. Alright. It does a lot of great things for me. It's like having a Necronomicon, a map, and a full heal all in one. Haven't found very much money though. 
That's a little strange. Book us in. Lest I forget. Okay, this is doable. Just keep him slowed down and I'll be all set. All set. Wow, he drops green nubs. Which are really dangerous. One might say unreasonably dangerous. Yeah, you just uh, keep on taking hits there, buddy. I'll be on my way soon enough. And you can get on with your... Well, I guess you can't. You'll be dead. I'll take my food. And check the deal with the devil room. Eh, yeah, let's see. I've already had both of these before, and... I'm doing enough damage, so I'll skip. Moving on. The Depths. The Leapers. Whoa. Well, I was screwed no matter which way I dodged on that one, I guess. I think. Sometimes it's hard to tell. Yeesh. These things... Very dangerous. What's this pill do? Balls of steel. Nice. And I will blow these up. Well, I've got enough keys to make this happen. Tammy's head or Book of Sin. Mm. I think I will keep the book. Just to see what it is able to drop. Plus, I'm already spraying shots all over the room anyway. Whoa. A little spite shot there at the end. One more time into the breach. Hey, nice. The relic drops spirit hearts. So this'll pay for itself after a few rooms. Uh, assuming I don't just keep taking hits like crazy. Which I very well may do. Wow. What is that, the th eighth penny I've found all run? Whoops. There's some weird graphical stuff going on with these guys. I don't understand it. I don't really need to. Let's hit the library. No Book of Revelations still, because clearly the game is trolling me. I just felt like blowing the room up, that's all. And we have a shop that I still can't afford anything in. Not doing super great, but not doing badly either. That could end soon. There's an awful lot of these guys in here. Now there are substantially fewer. Righto then. Works for me. I guess I shouldn't worry so much. Everything works out. Haha. -ha. How do you like being asynchronous, assholes? You love it, don't you? Yeah. Booyah. And this isn't worth my time. I suppose I might as well try the shop. I might be able to get something half price that'll dramatically increase my odds of winning. Like, um, like, uh, I have no idea. Like a blue candle, for instance. Well, 
That fell right in my lap. I should not be overconfident because it wrecks me without fail when that I do that. See, like that hit I took just there. That wasn't overconfidence, but it was an example of what would have happened if I had been overconfident and taken the hit because of that instead of mere incompetence. See how it works? Whoa. I dodged that by the freaking skin of my teeth. And I did not dodge that at all. Because reasons. Not to be confused with raisins. Does anybody actually like raisins? I've never heard anybody say, oh boy, a box of raisins. Especially not at Halloween. You healthy types that give kids raisins, you ought to be ashamed of yourselves. Where the hell was I aiming that candle? And why? There, that's how you aim a candle. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Yes, seep into the floor so that I may traverse this area. Monstro 2. Yes. Both of my weapons... Whoa! What the hell, man? Oh yeah, he was about to do that, wasn't he? And then, to illustrate the point, he did. Look at you just uh, zipping around without a care. This is one angry dude, isn't it? Wow. Look at him go. This is a little ridiculous. I gotta kinda aim my shots to where he lands. That's the key to this. Of course, there's still a bunch of problems all over the room. There's one now. Ah. He is not letting up. This is... a vicious fighter. Well, that's okay, because I'm about to get me an angel item. What will it be? It will be the miter. Which will further... do something with something. I don't know. Alright, time to find the fight with Mom. Wow, look at this room. Being as obnoxious as possible right when I walk in the door. Look at that enemy being as obnoxious as possible right when I walk in the door. Push pin. I'll just go ahead and keep my fork, thanks. And I can certainly afford to find out what's in here. One key for one spirit heart, all things said and done. Yeah, I guess I'll do this too. I mean, what else am I going to use these for? Keys, I mean. I'm sure I will find some sort of answer. You know... I just really didn't see a way to dodge that in time. I'm sure there was one, but I couldn't think fast enough. Whoa! We'll do that. And you know what? I'm just gonna stick with bullets because I can't aim the candle and hit these guys quickly enough. <coughs> 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 
excuse me. But I've got lots of offense going for me. Now if I can just stay alive long enough and not choke to death, I should be able to finish it up. Oh boy, oh boy. My favorite. Leapers. I think we all know how I feel about leapers. Sometimes it just takes getting lucky. You know what? Good enough. Woo. That was a little intense. And that was a little bit easy. It evened out. I would love to get that spirit heart. Guess it wasn't in the cards. Whoa. No. Bad zombies. Wicked, evil zombies. Or knights, if you prefer. They don't look like any kind of knights I've seen, but they kind of act like dark nuts. Telepills! I'm somewhere else now. Now I am over here. Now I am over here. Give me back my sun card. Give me back my bullet. There we go. Now we can get out of here. Not really much point in exploring the rest of the level at this point. 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 Marklar, Marklar. Right. This will be... Well, I was going to say easy with the candle, but I guess what I meant to say was difficult because... It's blue now. Yeah. You just, uh, continue to piss off and I'll continue to burn things. Getting a little heavy on the enemies here. If we could just kind of, uh... Take it easy on those, if you don't mind. That'd be great, thanks. Shit. Alright. Made it. Still got two floors to go, though. With my increased range. Was range ever even a problem? I don't think it was. But if it wasn't before, it's not now, so it continues to not be a problem. Hooray. These guys are a little bit of a problem. At least a little bit. I could candle them, but it's kind of hard to get close. Maybe I'll candle something in here. Maybe I'll get locked in a corner and unable to escape my own stupidity. Wow. These guys are just being all kinds of a dick. Um, I guess he died off screen. Fine. I didn't want him crapping up my style anyway. Be gone, screaming things with wings. Bah! They're always trying to telefrag me. I don't know why when they could just shoot bullets at me until I die. That's what everyone else does. It seems to be a pretty effective tactic, all things considered. Ask those guys. They know the score. Alright. Found the boss. It's not quite Mom's heart, but it's close. It is death. Well, at least we'll get a cube of meat. 
I didn't have enough of those last game. Yes, you continue to be slowed down, and I will continue to candle at you whilst you are slowed down. And between these things, I think we're going to get along just fine. And an angel room. My, my. The Bible. Eh, that's a really great item, but I think I'm gonna stick with the candle. Truth be told. Again, I don't want to um, jinx my chance for another new ending. I think I'm closing in on the final one. I don't know, though. I'm sure someone will call me on it if I'm wrong. But, as long as I win, that's the important thing. Not if I had fun, and not the journey. Only winning. What is this pill? You know what? I don't even know if I want to take that pill. It can only do bad things at this point, I think. Okay, bad gas isn't horrible. I mean, it is if you have to live through it, but... If you're on the receiving end... I have mentioned my strict no-farting policy before, have I not? Cause that shit ain't cute. At this point, all the curse room is gonna do is take out too many of my hearts. With very little chance of getting a good item, so I think I'm gonna skip it this time. Instead, we are going to go downwards, yes? Or, I'll do the arcade for a little bit. I've only got, like, a few cents. Yep, spirit hearts are what I was hoping for, and spirit heart is what I got. And also, uh, the Joker, which will take me to a free deal room, or maybe angel room. Took me to a devil room, where I can go down to Shoal. Um... I don't think that's how this challenge works. I'm gonna go get my sun card back. I'll go down to Shoal later, when I'm not trying specifically to finish a challenge run. I promise. Okay, that was all that we had to do. You know what? I'm gonna blow up some of these things. I'm gonna blow you up. I'm gonna blow you up. Fish head. That will give me some flies sometimes. I'm just gonna keep this for now. Because I might need it on my way to the mom fight. That was dangerous. Yeah, come on down. Hang out with my candle. I've basically just got a kill zone corridor here. It's doing its job. And Wrath couldn't do his. Amazing that I didn't get lasered. I've still got my sun card for the mom fight. Which, if this keeps happening, I will need it. Okay, and the umbilicus, which sucks. I don't even have a clear concept of what it does, but it's never really helped. Alright. Let's get rid of these lasery eyes. And start candling. Handling is where you jump down next to a rope and try to grab hold of it at the last second. It's a very painful and foolish game that you tell your friends about and see if they're dumb enough to try it. Invented by my buddy Webb. Eh, we're about done here. 
Spider butt has appeared in the basement. Awesome. And like I say, I could go on, but I think I'll end the challenge right here. Because that also unlocked something else by the sounds of it. What could it be? Bitchin' Dollar Glasses. I'd forgotten about them and I don't remember what they do. Oh, money equals power, right. The more money you get, the higher your uh, attack goes. So, maybe I'll get that sometime. But now, what are we? Was that 4 for 4 or 5 for 5? I forget. <laughs> I think that was 5 for 5. But if it was, that's good. But the next one will probably be harder. We'll see when we get there. Until then, this is your old pal Rosser. Take a drink.